The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. On the Eagles Sports Network, I'm Tanner Swift, and standing alongside me is CN Swim head coach Jordan Taylor as the Eagles wrap up day two of the NCAA Swimming Championships. And coach, we've talked about all season in your preparation for the NCAAs and the way that you've trained. Why was today more important than ever with your training and preparing some of your athletes? Because it seemed like you were in every other race these last two days. Um, yeah, it's been a, a big couple of days for us uh, here at Nationals. and. Uh, I mean, today is an important day just because some of the individual races we had and um, with us getting off to a great start, there's kind of more expectation than, than normal and um, we're just trying to keep the momentum flowing. We had a great morning this morning, um, getting our girls 200 freestyle really back into the final um, tonight and set a school record this morning and it was perfect. Uh, um, CJ, our freshman, the 400 IM, uh, had a lot of nerves, our first ever national swim and she um, I went in next to get a great race and set a school record this morning, two seconds better than she's ever done before and got herself into the B final tonight and then uh, with Margaret, um, her best event, Children Freestyle, it's an event we've been working on the last few years together and um, there's been some ups and downs with that and she's been All-American multiple times with it and we, um, we uh, had a lot of expectation coming to this I guess, she's been preparing, preparing really well for it and um, this morning was a, a big step in, in that direction for her. She came in and smashed the school record and um, put herself number one in the country going to the final tonight and um, the job well done as far as this morning goes. And then the girls for uh, medley really just missed out on the A final finishing ninth this morning um, but set another school record so we can't ask for any more than that and it was like, just a great morning. Um, and tonight swimmers are getting a little bit tired of a lot of swims and um, at a national level to have multiple uh, prelims and finals uh, back to back to back. It's, it's been hard on their bodies uh, and also the emotions that come with it. Um, but they, they handled it pretty well and tonight we set another school record in the Tuna Freestyle Relay and um, finished, um, finished fifth um, in that uh, final in All-American again. It's uh, perfect for us. And with Margaret, individually, uh, the Tuna freestyle, um, a little bit of a bummer for her to finish uh, and get fourth in a, in a race that I, I believe she has the ability and talent to win, but uh, she she was done great. I mean, she's All-American again, top four in the country and one of the best ever as far as her time goes for Division Two. so it was, it was perfect. Um, and then um, CJ dropped more time in the B final tonight and went out and then won it, um, again with a lot of nerves and uh, pressure on her. She was really excited but ner nervous before the race and uh, again execute some of the things we picked up on this morning and um, everything we've been working on is just executing these skills better and better as we go through the season and, and that's what they've done and uh, that's another school record for her and she finished uh, ninth and won the B final and then the girls four in the medley really just there they finished and uh, were fourth in the B, uh, B final just outside the time they've done this morning um, but again to be 12th in the country I'm um, getting a lot of points for this team and the girls are tired. There's a lot of swimming in two days and um, they give their all um, and that put us 12th in the country. We can't, can't complain of that. You're breaking records in the morning prelims, but you're also continuing to break those records in the evening yeah. as well. What's, yeah. what's been the key for you in, the, in that layover period? Um, I guess for us, it's uh, the big, big thing is that we brush up on some things we do in the morning. Um, our, our swimmers are used to performing better at night. Um, it's just always been something that they, they do and they get themselves up for the, uh, the occasion, a national final. Like That doesn't come along every other weekend, so they're, they're, they're good at getting excited and, and getting themselves ready for it, but um, it's a reason why we do doubles a lot of the time through the, through the year. They'll work hard in the morning, they'll come back a few hours later and swim again in the afternoon, so the body knows how to get faster and so even better at night um, and uh, it was it was um, great uh, just a kind of normal mentality for them they, they get into the moment and, and come back and swim even better at night and uh, yeah I couldn't have asked more from them <laughs> Jordan thank you for your time and uh, best of luck rest of the week thanks <laughs> ECN head coach Jordan Taylor I'm Tanner Swift on the Eagles Sports Network